Good evening, Newfoundland and Labrador. Since the last public advisory, the province has recorded one new confirmed case of COVID-19. The new confirmed case was reported on Sunday, July 4th, and is a female in the Eastern Health region between 40 and 49 years of age, and is related to travel within Canada. There is no one in hospital due to COVID-19, and at the same time, Eastern Health is working on a ship that is anchored in Conception Bay. There are 12 crew members on board who have COVID-19. At this time, testing of all crew has taken place aboard the ship. All are isolating on board the vessel and there is no risk of community transmission. That means there are now 17 active cases of COVID-19 in the province and so far 161,510 people have been tested. In other news, please say that a 22-year-old man is deceased following a single vehicle rollover crash that occurred on Route 320 near Trinity on Sunday. When officers arrived at the scene, they located a man trapped underneath the vehicle who was deceased. A passenger was transported to the James Payton Memorial Hospital in Gander for treatment of unknown injuries. At the time of the, of the crash, neither occupant was wearing seatbelts, and the investigation is continuing. And finally, the scope of practice for optometrists in this province is expanding. Optometrists may now treat and manage patients diagnosed with glaucoma. When completing the optometry program, optometrists do receive formal education and training. In your weather forecast, a warm-up is on the way and it's going to be a fairly nice day for most areas tomorrow. Those details right after this. We were getting married in the most beautiful rural setting. My mom got sick and couldn't be with us for our big day. I was heartbroken. Thankfully, we discovered ExploreNet. They responded right away and connected us to high-speed internet. Our big day was incredible because it felt like mom was there. ExploreNet. Connect to what matters. After several days of cool and unsettled weather, it did come to an end for the most part today. As we head through the forecast tonight, it is going to be a bit unsettled. Uh, we are looking at a chance of showers or drizzle in St. John's tonight and a low of 11. Getting down to 10 in Gander with a similar story, Cornerbrook tonight, a low of 8 with a chance of showers. Now as we head through the forecast for tomorrow, we are looking at a mix of sun and cloud for the majority of the island portion of the province. Temperatures anywhere from, uh, say, 18 degrees to uh, about 27. Uh, the warmest spots will be in central tomorrow. So we are getting back to more summer-like weather and even above seasonal in uh, in some cases. And as we head through Labrador, Happy Valley Use Bay tomorrow, getting up to 29 with mostly sunny skies. Showers expected for Nain and for Lab City. As we take a look at your extended forecast, we'll start out in St. John's, where it is going to be a fairly nice Tuesday with a mix of sun and cloud and 20 degrees. And then for uh, Wednesday, a similar story, sun and cloud and 20, sun and cloud and 19 on Thursday, sun and cloud for Friday. And Saturday, we are looking at sun and cloud with about a 60% chance of some showers. And then as we move into Gander, sun and cloud and 27 for tomorrow, we are looking at a chance of showers as we head through your Wednesday, but uh, conditions clear once again Thursday through to your Friday. Saturday, we are looking at a mix of sun and cloud with a chance of some showers. And then finally, as we head in the corner, Brook 23 will be the high for tomorrow under a mix of sun and cloud. There's a chance of showers Wednesday and Thursday, fairly overcast on Friday. Some showers expected for your Saturday. That's a look at your news and your forecast. And now you can check out newfoundnews.ca for the latest.